I met our lovely Parker um, early in college, um, and we grew closer through our sorority um, during our sophomore year, and then we lived together um, our junior and senior year. I met Alex freshman year, and I have to admit, when I first met Alex, I thought he was a total teacher's pet and kiss ass. <laughs> During our senior year at Denison, I had grown close with both Parker and Alex, and I saw how kind, loyal, intelligent, and fun they are as individuals, and it became clear just how incredible of a couple they could be together. I'm nervous. I love you both more than I can express, and I'm ecstatic to be standing here today and sharing in your love and joy. <laughs> can I get a hug? I'm cold. <laughs> I'm sorry. As Alex and Parker have committed their lives to one another, families are joined, <laughs> friendships are forged and strengthened, and a new community of love is formed. As we bear witness to the reaffirmation of vows being made today, let us surround Alex and Parker with our whole hearts, our whole selves, and give thanks to God for all the ways that God's love is made manifest in their lives. Amare reminds me of how you are already living out God's loving kindness to one another and in our world. And my prayer for you both is that every day you share together would be full of love. I was fortunate enough to watch them over the Christmas holidays, relying on each other more and more, bringing each other into themselves to be able to be a stronger marriage. It was a wonderful scene to see. And it was great to see their love and commitment grow ever stronger. So I would like to give a toast to be able to live that carefree life that you so deserve going forward. Here, here. Cheers. I would just like to say that I'm so happy that he found a woman who he can now keep safe. Nothing could be better, you and me, chasing down forever after. It's been really fun to see how they have grown together as a couple, I guess that happens when you're dating for eight years. I mean, is this is this a common law marriage at this point? Like, I can definitely tell that Park that Alex has made Parker more organized because the Parker that I grew up with, her room looked like a bomb went off in it, and now she likes organization. I mean, she's a designer, so it must have something to do with dating someone who makes a spreadsheet for literally everything. Um, so I really can't wait to see what other habits they pick up from each other as they grow wrinkly and crinkly together. I don't think it's that random that we're all here. You know, Alex and Parker, they have this way of just bringing people together. And like, we all love these people and, and it really happy we could all be here together. 
And in the weird and wonderful way that God works, y'all's perfect day has been postponed over a year. You've had this pandemic, you've had a private wedding ceremony, you've had career changes and school, and more in between than what was originally planned. But here we are. And look out here. Look down these aisles of these faces that love you so much. But this group will never gather again in this way. Before God and in the presence of this congregation, Alex and Parker have made their solemn vows to one another. They have confirmed their promises by the joining of hands. Therefore, I proclaim they are now married. It is now my honor to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your beautiful bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to be the first to introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Alex Wood. Please stand and give them congratulations.